Hey guys, in this video, we're going to go over Minerva's next inventory and her location for the dates of March 6th to March 8th. Just in case you're new to Appalachia or just not familiar with who Minerva might be, she is a traveling vendor that goes from one location to the next, selling her plans for gold bullion at 25% off the normal gold bullion price that other vendors sell them for. When you do reach Minerva and she has something different in her inventory than what you see in this video, it's very likely that Bethesda changed something, and we hope that they do because we love change with Minerva. Okay, let's go. If you go looking for Minerva between the dates of March 6th at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time through March 8th at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, you will find her hanging out with the Raiders at Crater. And first up for sale, she's going to have some camp plans with the Water Well. It's selling for 563 gold bullion. Next, she's going to have some armor mods with the plans for the Secret Service Under Armor. It's 188. The Lighter Build Secret Service Armor Limbs is 188. And the Ultra Light Build Secret Service Armor Limbs is 375 gold bullion. Next, she's going to have plans for a power armor, starting with the T-65 calibrated shocks. They're 563. The T-65 jetpack, it's 1500. And finally, for the T-65, she'll have the rusty knuckles. I don't know if anybody ever uses the rusty knuckles, but it sells for 188 gold bullion. Staying in the realm for mods. For weapons, she's going to have the plan for the Warglaive flaming blade and the Warglaive shock blade. Both of those sell for 150 gold bullion each. Making her way to the bottom of our list, she's going to have weapon plans, starting with the gutter it's selling for 1000 gold bullion as well as whistle in the dark it also sells for 1000 gold bullion and just as a side note both of these plans are daily ops plans so if you want to try your hand at getting them through a daily ops for free or even picking them up a little cheaper from a player vendor it's definitely possible and save you a little bit of gold bullion and finally for the weapons category she's going to have the plans for the plasma caster it's selling for 563 gold bullion and this item alone in my opinion is probably the most powerful weapon in the game if you're spec'd for it correctly and for 563 it's really hard to go wrong using the plasma caster. This week's dad joke comes from Brian Turner who says, came home from work and asked my wife what's for dinner and she said, baby Wookiees. I then asked, how was it? And she said, oh, they're a little chewy. And just so you know, Brian, I've probably told that joke about 15 times after reading it. So thanks for the dad joke. If you've got a dad joke that you would like potentially highlighted at the end of one of my videos, then comment that dad joke down below and we'll see what happens. And if you're not already part of the Naked Vault Dweller YouTube channel, then do me the honor and hit the subscribe button. And if this video was informative, enough for you then give it a thumbs up too because that always helps and that's going to wrap it up for me i appreciate everybody for watching the video i'll see you guys in appalachia really soon love you bye uh hey guys i seem to have gotten stuck in the power armor hello is anybody out there i need to read off the end credits if somebody could just push the button to eject the power armor i gotta pee